this video, we will show you how to make simple report using Crystal Report and Visual Studio 2019 and of course still using Visual Basic VB.net. This is the basic reports. In the next tutorial, we will develop this report until perfect and with more details. But let's start with basic like this so you don't confuse in the advanced reports. First, all of the tools you need to create this report, you can download. We put link in the description. Just see the description on the video. First, open Visual Studio. In here, I'm using Visual Studio 2019. And I will create new project in here. And in the Windows Form application, let's select using Windows Form app in the .NET framework. It's uh, still a little different with just Windows Form app. You can scroll down to get Windows Form app with .NET framework. Because with this, we can select the version of our .NET. Okay. Next is let's say with simple report or just click report like this this is for our project i will put uh, my channel in here then click create in here if you see i prepare the database the structure is look like this this is the table structure with normal with primary key in the integer data type with name varchar value integer and price also integer in here and my database name is dbvb in here and this is the table name is the table report and in the table contain this data okay you can find the tutorial how to install some if you don't understand with this and how to insert or <laughs> if you need tutorial i will do this later in the next video okay after that uh, back to your visual studio and in here we need to add a crystal report viewer after you install crystal report uh, there is a uh, menu like this for reporting. You can just add a uh, crystal report viewer. Once again, you can download the tools, including crystal reports. The link on the description, just uh, click that link. Then we need also to add the button in here. I will make this button for showing. This is the basic, so I just create one, uh, just one form, so you don't confuse with this basic. So. Okay, uh, after that, uh, in here, the next step is we need to copy our uh, bin folder. If the bin folder contains uh, many data but this simple actually you can just right click and add new folder like this okay but uh, you can also doing something like this okay this is our project open our project and you can see here there is a bin and debug folder just copy this okay then you can paste on the our project because in here i'm sorry paste where is the paste this is the paste i'm sorry because uh, in the other case in this uh, folder is contain uh, system files so it's better method to doing like this 
after you copy a bin folder on the debug let's add item and in here choose the data set okay in here you can get on the common items and click data in here choose data set one and in here let's uh, add data table like this and suitable this with your database on PSP my admin with table detail report in here and then you can click ctrl plus l or you can click add a column like this okay this is same with the table in here name value and price don't forget uh, to select each column because the data type is not string in the number let's select uh, integer 64 the name is string and the value I'm using integer also okay and the price also and don't forget to set this as primary key okay this is same with this structure guys like this okay after that you need to add crystal report click again on the debug folder and choose reporting I will give the name is my report like this and click add and using the report wizard let's click ok in here select your project data because we have a data set one so we have this detail report in here and click next and in here select all fill to display and click next in the group by just click finish don't select anything okay it's like this we can uh, put this more uh, td in here this is the name let's see our data set yes this is name now after you make this more td you can uh, go to the next step just select your form one and then open again this is mass docking where is where is okay okay double click in the show button in here we need to import uh, my sql data import my sql dot data dot my sql uh, client like this you can see this is error because you don't add reference for my sql connection you can install my sql connection once again the tools you can download via link that we put on the description of this video then click at reference just type if you don't see my sql this is my sql.data this is not included on visual studio so you need to install this like crystal report okay after uh, like this you need to declare gym connection one as my sql connection cmd1 as my sql command okay team 
adapter one in here as uh, my SQL data adapter for data table team SU data table like this and in here I will click a uh, sub create sub uh, view data like this then in here is cmd1 equal to new mysql uh, comment this is uh, the mysql comment you can find tutorial how to operate mysql comment the tail report this is our table name okay using connection one this is our table name and asterisk mean all of record we will select okay adapter one in here okay, to new mysql data adapter refer to comment one adapter one the uh, fill with data table I'm sorry okay connection one of course dot uh, dispose in here and the button one click in here we need just make data table clear first then connection one is a river to our database new mysql connection in here i will make this bigger okay mysql connection this is server localhost and the user is equal to root and password is empty and the database is dbvb okay this is a mass true all of information you get from this because if you have mistake in here it will not work team my report my rpt in here as new my report that we just created okay. this is my report and in here uh, we will try to view data view data in here and my report my rpt dot database dot tables uh, is refer to the child report on our data set or our database set data source is data table and crystal report viewer one is dot report uh, source we will set to nothing first then we can copy this to my reports okay then let's try uh, to run our project this is all the code okay it is better to make just like this run this project if this works we need go to advance later okay this is uh, the report 
as basic you can also edit uh, the reports in here for example using uh, uppercase for start of words you can see here in the next video let's make uh, this report more advanced like based categories and match to report and etc uh, but for the basic i think is enough you can download all project all tools link on the description hope this video helpful for you